Let's discuss a question which appeared in KVPY 2014 under the string essay. And the statement of the question is let x and y be two digit numbers where y is obtained by reversing the digits of x. Suppose they also satisfy x square minus y square equal to m square for some positive integer m. So we need to find the value of x plus y plus m. Okay, to approach this, let's try to use the information that is given to us that is x and y are two digit numbers and y is obtained by reversing the digits of x. So we can take the number x to be a two digit number suppose ab. Okay, so in the decimal format the same number will be written as 10a plus b where a and b are the uh, single digit whole numbers and y will be the number obtained by reversing the digits so y can be taken as b a so in the decimal format it will be 10 b plus a now according to the given condition it is given okay, x square minus y square is equal to some perfect square m square and as you know the factorization of x square minus y square lead us to x plus y into x minus y equal to some perfect square m square. So from the assumption of x and y we can clearly see that on adding them x plus y will come out to be 11 times a plus b and on subtracting x minus y will come out to be 9 into a minus b. So on substituting the values here so we can see that this is coming out to be 11 into a plus b into 9 into a minus b equal to m square. Okay, now the thing is that you see that the quantity 9 is nothing but a perfect square. So 9 is a perfect square and the right hand side is also a perfect square. So 9 can easily be written as 3 square into 11 into a plus b into a minus b and that should be equal to some perfect square m square now let us see logically what does it imply logically you can see that 3 square is a perfect square so we need to make sure okay, these three product these three quantity on multiplying should give me a perfect square so 11 is a prime number so we need to make sure Okay, either the factor a plus b or the factor a minus b is providing me another 11 so that this 11 can be clubbed with that 11 either coming out from here or here so that that 11 gets multiplied to give us 11 square so that the RHS is satisfied. So either a plus b or a minus b should be multiple of 11 that we can argue. But what about a and b? a and b are nothing but single digit whole numbers so on adding and on subtracting they can maximum give 11 like on adding they can maximum give 11 it cannot be more than that or it cannot be more than uh, that uh, which is a multiple of 11 so safely we can claim a plus b should be equal to 11 so a plus b equal to 11 will lead us to um, solutions like 9 plus 2 8 plus 3 because as a and b are single digit whole numbers then 7 plus 4 and 6 plus 5 these are the possible solutions for a and b now you can see for the first case a minus b is coming out to be 7 which is not a perfect square so this solution is not a legal solution then 8 plus 3 corresponding to that a minus b is coming out to be 5 that is also not possible because 5 is not a perfect square then 7 and 4 will give us to the value of a minus b to be 3 which is also not possible because it is not a perfect square and the final one is giving us a minus b equal to 1 which is possible because it is a perfect square so this is the possible value of a and b that we can argue logically so now after getting the value of a and b to be 6 and 5 now let us quickly substitute the value of 6 and 5 in this equation so we can say that the equation will become 99 
into 6 plus 5 into 6 minus 5 so that will come up and that will be coming out to be m square so m square is equal to 9 into 11 square that is 33 square so the value of m is coming out to be 33 so we need to find the value of x plus y plus m so to find the value of x plus y plus m we know x plus y is uh, 11 times a plus b and we already know the value of a plus b to be 11 so the final answer is coming out to be x plus y plus m is nothing but 11 times a plus b that is 11 plus the value of m that is 33 so 121 plus 33 so the final answer is going to be 154